In this lesson, we shall prove the following theorem, which states that let P be a prime number. If P divides A squared, then P divides A, where A is a positive integer. This is how we proceed with the proof. Let the prime factorization of A be as shown. On squaring both the sides, we get the following. We are given that P divides A squared. Therefore, from the fundamental theorem of arithmetic, we can conclude that P is one of the prime factors of A squared. Now, using the uniqueness part of the fundamental theorem of arithmetic, the only prime factors of A squared are P1, P2, and so on till Pn. So, P is one of these factors. But, since A is equal to P1, P2, and so on till Pn, therefore, P divides A, thus proved. We now proceed to prove another theorem, which states that the square root of 2 is an irrational number. We shall prove this theorem by the method of proof by contradiction. This is how we proceed with the proof. Assume that the square root of 2 is a rational number. So, we can find integers r and s, where s is a non-zero integer, such that square root of 2 is equal to r upon s. Now, suppose that r and s have a common factor other than 1. Then we divide by the common factor to get square root of 2 is equal to a upon b, where a and b are co-prime. Therefore, b times root 2 is equal to a. By squaring on both sides and by rearranging, we get 2b squared is equal to a squared. Therefore, 2 divides a squared and hence 2 divides a. We can thus write a is equal to 2c for some integer c. Substituting for a, we get 2 times b squared is equal to 4 times c squared. This means that 2 divides b squared and hence also divides b. Therefore, a and b have at least 2 as a common factor. This is a contradiction to the fact that a and b have no common factors other than 1. Therefore, our assumption that square root of 2 is a rational number is not correct. Thus, square root of 2 is an irrational number.